dear friends let me show you the demonstration of first application just go on the google and type classroom screen dot com and after typing this you can go on the page of classroom screen and this kind of page will be visible it's very easy to install you just have to launch the new classroom and after launching it will just show you page like this and very beautiful features this classroom screen is having you can see few op options here if i want to change this background of the screen i just go on the background and you will see many many photos still photos and some animations also you can click on any and your background image will get changed but i always prefer animation because animation gives you different impact i will show you how uh, suppose i click on this image and you can see here on this image this is an animated image and uh, while teaching in classroom student might might get, get impact that they are sitting on the seashore and water is coming towards them it's like wave of knowledge that knowledge is coming towards them and very beautiful animations classroom screen is having you can select any there is second option called random names suppose i want to type something i can uh, type hello or i can choose any option here then dice is there then if you are playing any game with the students you can choose this option of dice and it is very much useful in the quiz also there is one more option student sound level suppose in the classroom students are making any noise so this will show you actually the level of the noise and you can press on this bell icon if noise is more the bell icon it will uh, have some sound and students will come to know that we are making more noise and they will keep quiet this is one of the beautiful option so i am uh, making this uh, disable okay so next is draw before that uh, qr code is there i will uh, tell you that later in text box you can type anything you can choose any pane you can choose the color and you can type or write anything you want suppose i want to say hi to my students or i want to draw some diagram i can do that with help of this tool then next is a uh, work symbol very beautiful uh, feature it is suppose on the screen if you want student should be silent so you can uh, enable this symbol there is one more option that is whisper you can ask students to speak slowly there is ask neighbor if they have to discuss something they can ask uh, to their neighbor and if they are doing any group activity you can have this symbol enable that is work together then next is traffic light it is one of the beautiful uh, feature of this classroom uh, screen if any quiz is going on or you are uh, doing any examination you can ask student to stop just click on this button this red button means stop you can ask student to wait by this yellow color and you can ask student to start or go with this color so this is one of the nice feature of classroom screen then we have timer here you can put timer for uh, any examination or any activity you can keep stopwatch stopwatch facility is also there then we have clock here if you want to enable clock on your screen you can enable this clock over here and we have calendar also if you want to give some schedule i'll time table of the next week or any other schedule or you if you want to show any demo you can use this calendar over here and there is one option right side here that is if you don't want all these icons here you can ask students uh, it's not there or you can again enable it and this one this qr code is there if you want your students to join the class you can ask your students just go uh, open your mobile scan this qr code and join the class so they will be easily able to join your class with the help of this qr code so this beautiful features are there 
and it's freely available by friends and it can be used effectively in teaching learning purpose. Then I will be showing you one more uh, technology tool that is whiteboard.fi. Just go on the Google and type whiteboard dot fi and visit the page of this uh, website and here you can see the options new join we have not created any class uh, yet so we will uh, say new class and you just have to type your name so i'll type my name sandhya k and enable waiting room uh, lobby enable image upload for students you can uh, check in any you want and create new class okay so after creating class it will uh, allow me to use my class and my whiteboard this is the room code this code I can give to my students and my students can join with me in this whiteboard okay so uh, here uh, already I had done some work so I'll clear this whiteboard and let us see what we can do here here you can see free drawing mode is there so you can use it for you can select it and uh, you can draw whatever you want okay then there is an eraser if you want to erase it you can erase there is draw text you can draw a text box and you can type anything if you want to type here lines and arrows are also there you can select any line and you can put the line here then some figures are there so if you want to draw a triangle you can have it if you want to draw a rectangle you can draw a rectangle if you want to draw a circle you can have circle here some other shapes are also there if you want to insert an image for example, I want to insert this image of a child sitting on the chair with mobile. I can uh, insert this image here. And uh, if I want to insert background image, for example, this is a background image of stay home, stay safe. I want to put it on the back side, on the background. You can put it here. So some color combinations if, if you want to select. So I have uh, chosen this uh, uh, color and I want to have this kind of shape. So colorful boxes I can put. I can put some text box inside and I can write. So whatever things you want to do, it's, it works like your uh, chalkboard and it's very easy to use. It, it is very user friendly and children or students, they really like this kind of thing. So whiteboard, just visit whiteboard.fi and create your classroom, share the room code with your students and enjoy this facility freely. Suppose you want to record your lecture and you want to send it to students or you want to upload it on Google Classroom or on Zoom. You don't want to be live but you want your pre-recorded lesson. There is one uh, best feature that is presentation tool. Just go on the presentation tool presentation tube and you can see the presentation tube tube.com go on that website and on this website you can have a login you can register it for free it's freely available after logging in and after registering you will get an icon like this on your desktop so click on this icon on present this will look like this so you have to open your file you can just uh, open the file and uh, you can record start recording it will get uploaded the ppt whatever you want to choose you can have webcam only you can have slides plus webcam you can have if there are more people you can have more people on the screen and only screen option is available 
then recording button is here pause is here and stop is here and review all all the uh, four things you can uh, see over here that is the best feature of presentation tube and uh, if you have some slides you can show it here if you want to write something you can select it and you can write on the board if you want to draw something you can draw over here with the help of this drawing tool if you want to show something on the google you can just go on the page and google you can show some videos from youtube also you can share the screen and uh, you can choose the camera front camera and uh, very beautiful features this has so for recording your video or recording your lecture you can use presentation tube recorder and it's uh, freely available for all the teachers there is one more recording tool that you can have that is screencast o matic just go on the google and type screencast o matic and you will see this application and it's freely downloadable you just download that and uh, start recording for free you can start recording for free it will show icon on the screen front screen and you can start recording you can start whatever you are doing on your screen you can record that uh, but it has time limit of 15 minutes only so you have to do multiple videos and you can join that so that facility is available on uh, screencast automatic now i will be showing you one more beautiful website that is renderforest.com on renderforest you can uh, create your videos it is a website maker also and uh, it provides some features where you can have animated videos it is one of the beautiful thing i have ever seen you can just sign up and log in and uh, you can create some videos if i uh, click here on create videos it will uh, show me various features like there are 900 500 skill can see explanator video toolkit 3d explanator toolkit it is having some white board animation clips then uh, multi color blast logo is there solid logo renewal we have quick quick logo animation blazing cube so many option just visit this site it's very beautiful and on render forest if you see uh, it will give you uh, option for build website also because you want to create a uh, animated video just go on the home page and get started it will show you what do you want to create logo video website or mock up i i click here that uh, i want to create a video then again click on create a video and uh, it will uh, take me to this page suppose i want this explanator video toolkit i will select for the purpose of demo only and uh, it will give you a beautiful feature so create now it will ask me load a preset or add my script for this purpose i just uh, uh, load a preset so there might be many uh, these kind of pictures product promotion suppose i want web design agency promotion research summary is there suppose i want to do this i am going to use a ready story so this ready story is available and you can put your uh, text here you can edit it there is edit option after creating it and it will show you actual demonstration okay if i click on uh, take ready story so this will take to uh, this page if i want uh, to put it here hello how are you so i can type over here my text hi and it will create a suppose i am typing here hi how are you and i save it it will get saved here and let me go to the next page it will ask me for some new text suppose i am changing the text here that i want to go back and i have reached so 
all the text will get saved here 